good evening so next we will be learning about um, asds nb100 uh, then your other publications that are uh, available as pdf so this enp reader is basically the software that helps you view all this it opens up like this there is a bookshelf and under that you will have all the publications this will list all the publications that uh, UKHO is having but I will show you this what whichever is uh, a darker shade suppose this are all darker shades this I am not having permits and this I am having permit and I will minimize it and once you click uh, the site you can uh, this button here you will be able to see which date the permit expires and if the data is up to date or not so these are all my ASDs Admiralty Sailing Directions then comes NP100 then comes my uh, guide to practical use of ENCs uh, NP232 how to uh, NP294 how to keep my Admiralty products up to date Nautical Almanac then Isla Voyage System and Admiralty Guide to ENC Symbols used in Nectis and then you can see the shade difference this is a bit uh, darker and this is a bit uh, lighter this I am not having a permit for so I won't be able to open it but this books I will be able to open it if I double click it it will open up as a separate uh, file and this toggle bar will come to view book so bookshelf is the whole list of all my publications and view book will give me the book which I have opened I can open multiple books at the same time you can see in view book this is Norway pilot this is my uh, practical use of ENCs and again uh, how to use an ASD uh, this I have already made a video <coughs> on paper publications the concept is the same so I will advise you to check out the ASD how to use the ASD uh, paper publication video that I had published that video will give you an idea of how to use the ASD and corrections nowadays are all uh, digital so there is no need to worry about corrections then comes suppose I want to use uh, an ASD for my current voyage I am somewhere in Haifa so NP49 should come up 49 so this is how the NP volume will come up and in this uh, I will request you to watch the video about uh, paper publication that I already published you will be getting an understanding of how to use this publication now if I want to go to Haifa Haifa will be H Haifa Haifa 7.183 4, 5, 6, 7.183 okay. So I have uh, come out to Haifa and as my third mate had pointed out to me I can directly go and search on the search bar for Haifa and it will come up then suppose you want to take a printout there is no option for printing it out directly from here you can uh, click it or you can con uh, use the control P icon what you need to do is you have to use the snapshot so the snapshot will give you a page and then you will have to print it out this is how uh, you can take a printout from ASD use, uh, from the ENP uh, reader there is no other options 
so suppose i took a snapshot i'll just take a printout then i can file it and if there is any uh, update it will come up you can see the border is red suppose i go a little bit more there is no red border that means there is no update to this so in this point there is a red border that means there is an update for this so th the one i have to check is this side if if this page has an update the update will come up here so this is basically how you will use uh, the ENP reader how to use the ASD you will have to check out uh, the older videos uh, that was based on paper publication it's the same next comes the tools so tools will have five options one is my certificate that is the updation of uh, updation update condition of my uh, ENP reader I'll just have to generate and then view it so my update will be listed always remember the ENP ASD will be updated as per chart and all the digital publications ALRS volumes will be updated one week in advance so uh, the chart correction had come to week 4 same the ASDs had been updated to week 4 next comes uh, how to update it so this is how I will update it as well as I update my permits sorry I forgot to show you my these books you can see this is a bit yellow in color that means my permit is about to expire you can see the permit is expiring in four days and if the permit had already expired it will come up and as blue so uh, to get the permits I'll just have to click this then uh, I'll have to update it click the next button over the internet over the media or email then now it's not connected uh, to the internet I'll just click and I'll have to press the request button I'll show you how to update it uh, along with this then comes the load ENP load ENP is basically uh, to update all the ENP volumes in your ENP reader even if you are having a permit or not this will update the publications uh, within this ENP reader then once you get the permit you will just uh, install the permit and you can read it so this is basically <coughs> an update of your ENP reader it's not an update of your permit then the user settings then activation which are uh, ENP readers you have to activate and the certificate these are the five options that come up in tools view book and bookshelf I believe you got a good understanding of how to use the ENP reader uh, we'll see you in the next video and I will uh, try to update uh, my ENP reader and add it as uh, a continuation to this video now on my ENP reader you can see in the bookshelf I will show in the bookshelf the NP100, NP735 and NP31423 all three have expired permits I won't be needing permit for NP31423 uh, because it's a nautical almanac of 2023 I'm having 2024 and 2025 as valid ones you can see in the tools I had shown you last updation so in the certificate under certificates if I check I will be having the last updated update as week uh, 5 of 2025 but my permit got expired on 31st January 2025 today is 31st January 2025 so how to uh, get this update so the permit I have already received by email so I will transfer it uh, transfer it to a USB and it has been connected to my system so to get uh, the permit I will just go to tools get notes to marinas and permits under this I will go to the next one as a media next I'll browse which location it was I had kept it on a USB then I'll just load it once I load it they are processing uh, the files 
and it has been automatically loaded now i'll finish it as soon as i finish it that enp has been successfully updated now you can see np100 and np735 they have both turned to blue and their permit expiry is for one year that is 31st january of 2026 and data is up to date if data was not up to date i would have to again do an update so this is how you will load a permit and uh, if you want to update you will just go to get notice to mariners and permits and if you are having an internet connection you will directly update it over internet thank you so uh, this video is about the enp reader updation remember enp updates come every wednesday and uh, chart updates come every thursday so once i start the enp reader i'll just go to the tools get notice to mariners and uh, permits next over the internet next request it will connect it uh, to the admiralty website and i have been successfully updated to week 5 of 2025 this was last week 4 so this is how you update enp reader